As assistant general manager, I preside over the fleet and facilities maintenance. We have a fleet of 58 fixed route buses and 35 paratransit vehicles. We operate about 22 and a half hours a day. It's a philosophy with me. We're trying to be as green and be as conservative with the taxpayer's money as possible. 2005, six and seven, we tried lower blends. We started off with a 5% then 11%. I sat down with our fuel supplier and I said, you know, everybody does 11. I know we can do 20. I know the vehicles inside now and I knew how our fuel systems work. We use a little over 600,000 gallons of biodiesel fuel a year. Our current fleet right now, we have 46 brand new buses. And uh, before that, our buses were 20, 21 years old. And they weren't as efficient, and they smoked with black soot terribly. Every time they'd take off, they'd cover the car behind them with dark black smoke. And when we made the change to the biodiesel, that immediately went away. One of our board members came in one day and said, all right, what's going on? I, what do you mean, what's going on? Well, I was stuck between two buses, and not once did I get covered in black smoke. I said then, our fuel's doing its job. With the quality fuel you get today, you don't have issues of filter plugging, and it flows more consistently. Well, we are proud of the fact that we're the only transit district downstate Illinois, leaving out Chicago, that managed to stay open and operate every single day throughout the last winter. In Peoria, we had record snowfall, and extremely cold temperatures. We've had one fuel supplier contracted for five years now. Uh, they guarantee that we have a good fuel supply that's clean. We have no issues with operation no matter what the temperature is. I can verify that we've had no issues whatsoever since we've got a good solid contract with a good provider that provides us with good clean biodiesel. And I can say this, this is what I believe. We have to leave this planet in a better shape than it's in right now for our children, our grandchildren, and our great-grandchildren. <laughs>